everybody welcome to today's uh, video I've been calling them episodes lately I don't know why I'm not a serialized show but whatever uh, so today we are talking about podcasts to help you in your career now as I've mentioned in other videos there are a ton of podcasts out there so I'm sure I'm only hitting like the surface so tell me in the comments what are your favorite podcasts which ones have you been listening to to help you in your career and I don't care if it's because it's industry related or because they go kid maybe I should listen to one on speech uh, because they give just good life information how to better yourself whatever let me know which ones you're liking and then be sure to subscribe so you find out about new videos coming up and can hear more about my favorite podcasts so one of the great podcasts for getting ahead is has actually stopped for the time being, but you can still listen to old episodes, and that is the Girl Boss Podcast with Sophia Amoroso. So she did a whole podcast series, and then life got crazy, and she stopped, but she has a good handful of episodes, and you just get to hear people's stories um, from really successful women who, how did they start out? How did they start their businesses? And there's some really good takeaways in them, like, one thing that you see is most people didn't just jump into starting their own business. They worked somewhere. They gained skills for a couple of years. They learned how that company did that. They hoarded their money during that time. So it's just interesting to listen to to hear how different people started their businesses um, and became successful in who they are today. So I highly recommend that one. Okay, another one I really like, but it has kind of a strange title in my opinion, is The Art of Likeability. So it is with a man named Arel Moody, he hosts it, and it's just a great podcast to, to kind of give some tips on how to start conversations with people you don't know. He does a lot about networking and walking into a room and how do you talk to someone you've never met before, how do you join a group, and just the importance of little things like smiling or asking a question or putting the attention on them. Things that deep down we know, but I think we forget how much of an impact they have. And he kind of goes into the reasoning behind that and gives a great reminder of why they have such strong impact. So you can get some just great tips on being more comfortable and in walking a room and meeting strangers through his podcast. So I really, really like it. Um, so even if you think you are highly likable right now, because I, I will admit that title is kind of like, God, I'm not sitting in a room with my nine cats eating Chinese like I have friends uh, so the title is a little mm, but it just kind of helps get ahead and get over that hump so that you can be really strong in who you are as a person and putting that out towards the world so I really really like his podcast and a lot of episodes are pretty short so they're great ones if you're just like needing a five-minute break or if you have a really short commute they're really great for that so highly recommend the art of likability one that is just straight up career advice is the happen to your career podcast so on that one they talk with a ton of different career coaches or experts and sort of uh, career advice career coaching related fields like networking or LinkedIn experts uh, productivity all of those things to help you get ahead in either the career you have or find your next job so I know they talked with Jenny Blake who wrote Pivot which is all about figuring out how do I get to that next job and what if it's a little different than I'm doing right now highly recommend that one um, but yes runs the gamut on everything career related to help you get ahead so I highly recommend that and then my last one is just kind of like a life one and I could like I said I could give you a ton of those we all have those that we like and maybe more I'll go in another episode but one of my favorite podcasts is the happier Pod the happier podcast with Gretchen Rubin and her sister Liz Craft. So if you listen to my video on podcasts to get ahead in entertainment careers, you heard me talk about happier in Hollywood. That's the one Liz does with her writing partner Sarah. But happier is just general life advice on how to be happier, how to build good habits, get the life you want. And that is with Liz and her sister Gretchen, who literally wrote books on how to be happier and tested sort of all the different theories of what will make you happy, and also wrote a book on habits. Plus, in the habits book, she talks about four tendencies. She created this fam 
Guys, I really can't talk. She created this framework called the four tendencies, which is the four ways that people deal with expectations. So even that can just help in learning how to manage your time, um, what type of work environment you would like, how you deal with uh, tasks at work. Uh, so I highly recommend the podcast. It's normally 30 to 40 minutes a week and you just get a couple of good tips to hopefully make your life happier and better and that will therefore roll over into your work. So I think it's just really helpful advice. I highly recommend it. I also highly recommend Gretchen's books. So I'll probably link to those in the description bar as well. So that is it for this video. I hope this helps you out. Like I said at the beginning, please let me know what you're listening to. I want to hear about what other people are really enjoying at the moment um, because I'm always willing to pick up another podcast. So I will see you in the next video and have a great day. Bye.